Hello students, welcome to the channel Easy Way to Physics with Jaya. Today we will discuss about multiple reflection, working of kaleidoscope and periscope and dispersion. Before that, did you watch my old videos uh, regarding that reflection, loss of reflection? If not, please go through that and learn well that also. Yentana multiple reflection. Tend mirrors, tendal code the law mirrors. Or a angle illa, a kidale or angle on dingle or angle illa, arrange the vechale. Avaki day, which again a row object in the image. Pala images mirror will get. Tendal code the law images namakut. For example, if there are two mirrors in 90 degree angles, which are in the other side, coin which are in the coin there. Image, moon images are mirrors. This phenomenon is multiple reflection. When two or more mirrors are kept at an angle, multiple images of an object can be formed. This phenomenon is called multiple reflection. In this case, there are images of forms in the mirror. There are images of forms in the mirror. There are images of forms in the mirror. For that, there is a formula also. So, that we will study. Next. Before that, uh, once again, the definition for multiple reflection is when two or more mirrors are kept at an angle, multiple images of an object can be formed. This phenomenon is called multiple reflection. How many images are formed in multiple reflection? For that there is a formula. The number of images formed in multiple reflection is equal to 360 divided by angle between the mirrors minus 1. 360 divided by angle between the mirrors that is given in a bracket then minus 1. So when you do the calculation according to Bodmas rule what is given in the bracket we will calculate first. After that, we will subtract 1 from that. Okay, board mass rule answer is not going to be done. Bracket is not going to be calculated. Bracket is not going to be calculated. That is not going to be calculated. 1 subtract. Now, we will see that the angle between the mirrors is 90 degrees. So, number of images formed here in this picture is equal to 360 divided by 90 minus 1. 360 divided by 90 is equal to 4. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. 3 images are formed in this picture. In front of mirrors, parallel light to which face to face side to which it is, other red or objective which it is. So, what is the angle between those two mirrors if they are kept face to face and an object is kept in the middle? The angle between them is 0. There is no angle at all in between them. So, 0 is the angle between those mirrors. In that case, the number of images formed is equal to 360 divided by 0 minus 1. 360 divided by 0, any number divided by 0 is infinity. So, here 360 divided by 0 is infinity minus 1. That is again infinity. That means you will get infinite number of images if you keep two mirrors parallel to each other and an object is kept in between them. Then the mirrors in a or objective chale if those mirrors are facing each other. See picture la noku how many images we can get infinite number of images in that case. And that is calculated in this way 360 divided by 0 minus 1. You can calculate the angle of 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 the angle the angle of 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 the what is it and how it works? We will learn now. Kaleidoscope and periscope. Multiple reflection is based on the instruments. 
ഇതെങ്ങനെ ഉണ്ടാക്കുന്നത് എന്താണ് ഉപയോഗം എന്നൊക്കെ നമുക്ക് പഠിക്കാം കാലിഡിസ്കോ ആക്ച്വലി ദിസ് ഈസ് യൂസ് ഫോർ ഫൺ പർപ്പസ് ചിൽഡ്രൻ ക്യാൻ പ്ലേ വിത്ത് ദിസ് ഓൾസോ ഡ്രസ് ഫേബ്രിക് ഡിസൈനേഴ്സ് ടു ഗീവ് ന്യൂ ഡിസൈൻസ് ടു ദ ഡ്രസ് മെറ്റീരിയൽസ് ഡ്രസ് മെറ്റീരിയൽസ് ഓൾസോ ആർട്ടിസ്റ്റ് ടു ഗെറ്റ് ന്യൂ ഡിസൈൻസ് ദ യൂസ് കാലിഡോസ്കോപ്പ് I will tell you how to make this. How do you do this? Uh, artists, fabric designers, they use it as well. They use it as well. That's how it is. Use it. Use it. Use it. Three rectangular mirrors. Three rectangular mirrors of the same size. That will be kept in the form of a pyramid. Then, back side of it can be closed with another mirror piece. Mirror, you know what is the mirror, difference between mirror and a glass. Glass will allow light to pass to the other side. Whereas mirror is reflecting it back. That means in a mirror the back side is coated with some opaque material. Which will not allow light to pass through it. Whereas glass is like window glass. Light can pass through that from one side to the other side. So remember always mirror and glass is different. Here you have to use three mirror pieces, three rectangular mirror pieces of equal size and, back, and arrange it in the form of a pyramid. Back side can be closed with another mirror piece. This is enough actually if you stick these three pieces, four pieces of mirrors then uh, kaleidoscope is ready. Now join them together to form a prism as shown in figure. Close one end of the prism with a small mirror base using glue and other end with a cardboard with a hole in the center. Uh, one, one end is closed with mirror, the other end with cardboard with a hole. Now insert the whole apparatus inside a cardboard tube as shown in figure. This is for safety purpose we are doing because it is made up of glass sometimes it may break. So we will insert the whole thing inside a cardboard. Put a cardboard tube. Then place some colored paper or broken bankers inside the prism and look through the hole in the center of the cardboard. A cardboard is thrown into the banker pieces so in the color paper or okay, kit no we will see different 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 designs enjoy the magic of multiple reflection oro mirror moonu naalu mirrors unda inathu ee naalu mirrors ilum thatti reflect cheythu reflect cheythu oru color ne nammal oru object ne nammal naalayittu kaanuvaan appo pala color ulla pala objects ittu keyumbo different different varieties of designs we can see അങ്ങനെയാണ് അത് ഇനി ഒരു ഡിസൈൻ കണ്ടു കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ നമുക്ക് അതൊന്ന് ഷേക്ക് ചെയ്ത് കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ വീണ്ടും അടുത്ത ഡിസൈൻ കിട്ടും സോ വി ക്യാൻ ഗെറ്റ് ഡിഫറെന്റ് തൗസൻഡ്സ് ആൻഡ് തൗസൻഡ്സ് ഓഫ് ഡിസൈൻസ് ഇൻ ദാറ്റ് ബാക്ക് ഗ്ലാസ് വെൻ വി ലുക്ക് ത്രൂ ദാറ്റ് ഹോൾ ഇൻ ദ കാർഡ്ബോർഡ് സോ ദിസ് ഈസ് വർക്കിംഗ് വിത്ത് ദ പ്രിൻസിപ്പിൾ ഓഫ് മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ റിഫ്ലക്ഷൻ നോ ഫോർ ദി എക്സ് യു മേ ഗെറ്റ് എ ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻ ലൈ explain the principle and working of kaleidoscope so how will you write the answer uh, first we'll write the principle behind kaleidoscope is multiple reflection or it works on the principle of multiple reflection when two or more mirrors are kept at an angle multiple images of an object can be formed image formed by one mirror acts as the object for the second mirror these two images form another image in the third mirror thus kaleidoscope makes reflections of reflections and all these images form a pattern inside the kaleidoscope like that it is working oru mirror il oru image form cheyidale aa image aayirikkum adutha mirror inde object aayittu work cheyunnathu വീണ്ടും ഈ ഫസ്റ്റ് മിററിന്റെ ഓബ്ജക്ട് ഫസ്റ്റ് മിററിന്റെ ഇമേജും സെക്കൻഡ് മിററിന്റെ ഇമേജും കൂടിയായിരിക്കും തേർഡ് മിററിന്റെ ഓബ്ജക്റ്റ് ആയിട്ട് വർക്ക് ചെയ്യുന്ന
അങ്ങനെ കരഡോസ്കോപ്പ് എന്താ ചെയ്യുന്നതെന്ന് വെച്ചാൽ ദ റിഫ്ലക്ഷൻസ് ഓഫ് റിഫ്ലക്ഷൻസ് ആർ മേക്കിംഗ് ഇറ്റ് മേക്സ് ഇമേജ് ഇമേജ് ഓഫ് ആൻ ഇമേജ് ഓക്കെ വൺ ഇമേജ് ആക്ട് ആസ് എൻ ഓബ്ജെക്ട് ഫോർ ദി സെക്കൻഡ് മിറർ ലൈക്ക് ദാറ്റ് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് വർക്കിംഗ് സോ വൺസ് അഗെയിൻ ഇമേജ് ഫോംഡ് ബൈ വൺ മിറർ ആക്ട്സ് ആസ് ദി ഓബ്ജെക്ട് ഫോർ ദി സെക്കൻഡ് മിറർ these two images form another image in the third mirror the kaleidoscope makes reflections of reflections and all these images form a pattern inside a kaleidoscope how the kaleidoscope is useful to us artist wallpaper designers fabric designers they are using kaleidoscope for getting new ideas of patterns then people use it for fun also for fun purpose children can look look through that for time pass and they will get more and more designs and colorful uh, designs they can see through that kaleidoscope then by changing the colored material inside the kaleidoscope we can get more and more different patterns periscope it also works on the principle of multiple reflection here two mirrors are kept at an angle of 45 degree at the bends of an z shape tube see look at the picture there is an z shape tube inside that uh, two mirrors are fixed at an angle of 45 degree light from a distant objects enter into the tube and form an image in the first mirror it then gets reflected down to the second mirror as shown in the diagram and then reflects back to our eyes oru z shape ilulla tube aanu adinte rendu bendilum rendu mirrors 45 degree il vechirikkunu appo oru distant object il ee kaanichirikkunna pole chitrathil kaanichirikkunna pole tube il vekke tube vekkaanengil oru distant object innulla light first mirror il adinte image form cheyunu aa image second mirror il veendum padikkunu aa second mirror la image nammada kannilekku ettunu നമുക്ക് കാണാൻ പറ്റുന്നു അപ്പോൾ ഒരു കുഴിക്കകത്ത് ഇരുന്നുകൊണ്ട് നമുക്ക് പുറത്ത് നടക്കുന്ന കാര്യങ്ങൾ ഒബ്സർവ് ചെയ്യാൻ പറ്റും അതിനുള്ള ഒരു ഇൻസ്ട്രുമെൻ്റ് ആണ് പെരിസ്കോപ്പ് ലൈറ്റ് ഫ്രം എ ഡിസ്റ്റൻറ്റ് ഓബ്ജെക്ട്സ് എൻ്റർ ഇൻ ടു ദ ഫസ്റ്റ് മിറർ ദെൻ ഇറ്റ് റീച്ചസ് ദ സെക്കൻഡ് മിറർ ആൻഡ് റീച്ചസ് അവർ ഐസ് ദിസ് ഇസ് വെരി യൂസ്ഫുൾ ഫോർ ആർമി മെൻ ബൈ സിറ്റിംഗ് ഇൻസൈഡ് എ ട്രെഞ്ച് ദ ക്യാൻ വാച്ച് ദ സറൗണ്ടിങ് പ്ലേസസ് യൂസിങ് എ പെരിസ്കോപ്പ് also people inside the submarines can watch outside using a periscope dispersion first i'll talk about rainbow you must have seen rainbow right it's very beautiful how rainbow is formed you know it is formed from sunlight normally sunlight contain all seven colors all beautiful seven colors but all these seven colors are moving with the same speed through the air and reaches our eyes so it is uh, looking like a white color all these seven colors together form a white color so normally we cannot see these seven colors in the sunlight but when they enter into another medium other than air if they are entering into water or glass these seven colors cannot move with the same speed they start moving different colors start moving in different different speeds so what is happening they start splitting see look at the picture it is a prism in that prism white light is entering into that prism prism is a pyramid shaped glass block into that when white light is entering what is happening these seven colors cannot move with the same speed they start bending this light start bending because their speed is different they are not moving straight they bend inside that prism and different colors bend in different angles so outside when they reach they are splitted in into seven colors 
This process is known as dispersion. White light normally air will go to move in. Why will go to move in. All seven colors are same speed. Move in. So they reach in our eyes as white itself. They appear as white in our eyes. But water lake or water media lake or glass media lake or speed is the same as the color and the speed is different. That is the split. That is the split. That is the split. So, in short, we can say the process of splitting of white light into seven colors is called dispersion. Here, when sunlight enters into the prism, different colors bend in different angles and the outcoming light is splitted into seven colors. This is a picture of rainbow. You must have seen this in many places, right? During rainy season, it is seen because air contains more water drops during rainy season. CD picture in a CD also you can see different colors because light is uh, reflecting in different angles from the CD. Also near the waterfalls, you can see uh, rainbow all the time. Because there more water drops are available. Summary. When two or more mirrors are kept at an angle, multiple images of an object can be formed. This phenomenon is called multiple reflection. This is the definition for multiple reflection. The number of images formed in a multiple reflection that is equal to 3 can be calculated as 360 divided by angle between the mirrors. First, you have to calculate that, then subtract 1 from there, that is the number of images. Then, kaleidoscope and periscopes, both are working on the principle of multiple reflection. Their uses also we studied. What is dispersion? The process of splitting of white light into seven colors is called dispersion. Rainbow is formed due to the dispersion of white light. Now, write and study all these notes and learn well. All the best. Thank you.